Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, talking about the uh, Windows Display Driver model version and what version you're running on your system. Um, a lot of uh, questions came with that and how to know if what is your driver model version on a specific driver. Like I said, the older the display driver or the less powerful it is, usually the older the Windows driver model it has, and more advanced gaming um, GPUs that are really powerful, like a lot of the latest NVIDIA and Radeon chips will, of course, have the latest display driver model. How do you find that? Well, simply go into your search, and in the search box, type DXDIAG. DX Diag, which is for diagnostics. When you run this command, it's going to actually check your drivers. It's going to ask you for the first time you run if you want to check compatibility with the driver signatures to make sure that they're official. Now here you'll have tons of information about your system, what it is, the Windows operating system, the type of gaming machine you have, and so on, and the processor and information here. Now, it's going to tell you what DirectX version you have, DirectX 12 in my case. But you want to have next page. There's Display 1, Display 2, because in my case, there's two GPUs. Some of you might have just one display here. So the main low power display of my machine is a uh, basic AMD Radeon graphics chip. And here, when you look at this page, on the Driver tab, you will see driver model. So this older one is running onto the Windows driver display driver model 2.7. Probably nothing more because it's probably not compatible with the latest versions. If your display adapter cannot run the latest features, your Windows display driver model might stay older. But if I look at my second display, which is an NVIDIA GTX 1660Ti, it actually runs on driver model WDDM 3.1, which is one of the latest, well, the latest model right now for graphics adapters, and probably would be compatible with uh, Windows Display Driver Model 3.2 when it comes out eventually. So this is how you know which driver model is actually running on your system. Uh, with the information of the um, the uh, diagnostics for the uh, DirectX diagnostics tool. And it will give you all the information also about the integrated uh, graphics, how much dedicated memory it has, how much shared memory it has, and so on. So mine has 6 gigabytes of um, display memory, but it shares um, 8 gigabytes with the system. If you look at the other one, the, the basic one, it only has 500 megabytes of display memory. Shares most of it with the system. Makes it a lot slower, of course. So you have all the information, the speed at which the, the, um, the digital encoder works and so on, and the GPU works. So it gives you a lot of details of what's in here on the display adapter. And uh, you have, of course, you can save all the information to your PC as a file so that you can actually refer to it later if you want. And uh, then you have, of course, sound and input if there's any information available there. So the DirectX Diagnostics tool is the way to find it. If you don't have the search or don't know how to do it, you can also run um, through anywhere. Like you can use Terminal. And here you can just type DXDiag, Enter and this will pop up the diagnostics tool for DirectX also. You can run it in the, uh, in the command line, the command prompt. This works both in Windows 10 and Windows 11. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.